You are watching Area DMG. Welcome back to Area DMG. I'm your host, Philip Wesley, the Mile High Mouth, and today we're taking a look at a Graceful Explosion Machine from Vertex Pop. Yeah, so uh, I don't really know much about this, so let's get into it. Um, from what I know, I think this is like a... Uh, what Vertex Pop told me is that this is a shooter... And let's see what's in it. Let's see options, in-game tips, controller vibration, of course. Music, sound, help controls, L moves, B is a blaster, Y is an energy sword, A is a sniper beam, X is missiles, flip and dash. So, uh, let's see. Is that all? Wait, continue, blaster, energy sword, a little bit about each of these types of items. Collect the crystals shoot these things. So we're going to go be shooting the crystal gems. Here we are on our trip to home world to, to murder things. Anyways. <laughs> we're being attacked by eyes. They look like bugs to me, actually. Okay, things happen. And, um, I guess we're lost. This is a pretty simple story. Oh, we need fuel. And here we go. Magneto, Magnetos, Mag, Magentos Prime. Zero of nine complete. Wait, six more levels. 14, 23. Okay, cool. Wow, there's a lot of levels. Okay. Hmm. This is a tutorial mission. Okay. Phase one. L move. Phew. Start blaster. B. ZL flip. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. Uh, there are combinations or something. So far, so good. We got a bunch of these things showing up. I really like the uh, the look of this game. Oh, whoops. So holding this doesn't. Oh, I've got fuel, and then it overheats if you hold it too long. Okay, I get in the hang of this. Huh, overall, the, um, hmm, mm -hmm. it's pretty simple. Let's see, there's, I guess we don't have any of the other stuff yet. Cave systems, they loop around. Walls are, okay. Base complete. You can't just, apparently, like, keep firing, because otherwise stuff will overheat. Oh, yeah. Yep. Mm hmm. Okay. Interesting. Huh. I wonder if hitting the walls hurts me. Nope. Walls don't hurt me. Nice. Makes me think of Defender just a little bit. Which is pretty good. Get the crystals to recharge your your power. Ooh. One thing you can't really tell from the images here is that uh it's got like a HD rumble. Um, which is a nice feature that the the um, Nintendo Switch actually tends to uh they tend to emphasize it. Although very little stuff uses it, like, to a really good effect. I would say that Snake Pass uses it pretty well. Um, this one so far seems to use it pretty well. I don't know how it is with the, uh, with the Joy-Cons. I'm using a uh, Pro Controller for this. What we're going to go ahead and do is definitely go through a couple phases of this to let you guys see a little bit of uh, what this game is all about. Oof. It is all about um, killing things and getting huge combos, right? Yes. I am okay with that. And you collect these. I oh, let's see. Nope. Oh. I got hit. I wonder how I mean, it sounds like you could um you have to kind of watch yourself with the with the power-ups and such. Though I think they give us those power-ups pretty simple pretty easily. Makes me think a little bit of defender, just a little. Just a little. 
but it's nice and so far so good with the uh oh we have a new weapon this is the sniper beam you hold a for the sniper beam nice so I have all sorts of kinds of uh nice I have all sorts of kinds of weapons for this so I've got um, these ones which are good for like if I'm surrounded by stuff oh that's an ability okay dash through enemies without taking damage but enemy bullets will always hurt oh okay Oh no, I have no power? Okay, so I guess this is the one that I use to get these and then the other power. Yeah, they, they kind of don't really explain it, which is okay, because then I can just learn it. Which, to be perfectly honest, isn't that kind of what you want to do in a uh, shooter like this? Kind of learn your power-ups yourself. Oof! Yeah, it gets tough to avoid the enemies, which which is why they want you to go ahead and, uh, and and zap through them. Hmm. Okay, whenever I do that, I've got... Ah, there we go. So far, so good. Actually, I kind of like this. Um, I was thinking it reminds me a little bit of Defender, but... Hmm, oof, we have no... Oh... Yeah, we need to get these, we need to collect energy crystals. Oof, and we died. So it's actually much more difficult than I was expecting. Because um, when I saw it, I was like, yeah, this looks like it might be too easy. No, it, it offers a, um, a decent amount of um, variety so far. Um, I've only seen what the first couple things these look like. And here you get a little feel for. Ah. Okay. So this one is the one that can overheat. I wonder if I can upgrade that later on. Yeah. Thankfully, those don't hurt me. Lots of mobs. Music doesn't seem too bad either. You probably won't be able to hear too, too much of the music. But, um,. It's pretty decent. Yike. Like Defender, you have to go around um, killing the enemies and... Uh, the basic idea is to get rid of them. Yeah, okay. Oof. Yeah. You have to, yeah, there's a lot you have to keep watching through it. It's one of those games where talking over it a lot would actually make it a little more difficult than it should be. Oof. Well, back to phase three. Hmm. <laughs> but yeah, overall, uh, how embarrassing actually. Yeah. These combos. There's a there's a oof. Okay, I was expecting this be, this to be kind of like simple. It's probably gonna be like one of those things like tumble seed where you're like, oh, it looks simple, but it's actually quite difficult. Let's try and make sure that we can get to at least the next power up before. Uh, <laughs> any type of game over. <laughs> Yike. Whew. Okay, get let me get the uh, get the power ups. Save the world or save the ship. Okay. Oof. Okay. So that one's kind of more of a steady laser. Oof. No, 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 no. Yike. 
Okay, I think this is the last one. Let's take him out. Excellent, level complete. All right. Woo! So, uh, yeah, so far, uh, uh, so not so far so good. Mm-hmm. Hey, it's a mid score. Nope. Run one three, and this should give us up oh, last weapon. Tap for burst fire, hold to continue fire, left stick to direct missiles. Phew. There's our burst fire. Ooh, they bounce. That's useful. But yeah, this is a graceful explosion machine. A kind of difficult uh, Rezogun style uh, shooter. Pretty good so far. Lots of stuff to dodge, lots of mobs. Not too bad. Mm hmm. There we go. Oop. Basic idea of these clear the level. Lots of enemies. Okay, we'll get these. Whoa. I need to start making sure I hit that thing so that I know, like, so I can avoid the enemies. Because, yeah, I can dodge. Ugh. As long as I don't dodge into them, I'll be fine. If you haven't noticed, there is there is all sorts of chaos going on here. Okay. As you're trying to avoid stuff overheating and such. Ooh, almost done with this level. But yeah, so far this is Graceful Explosion Machine. It's one of those where I think I'm gonna have to play a little bit more, a lot more of this before I uh, go ahead and start with like a review or whatnot. But so far. I like it. It's challenging and interesting. The music seems pretty good. I should uh, probably be playing this with headphones. And um, it looks so far like a pretty decent... Um, there was a really good PSP um, shooter called Platypus near the beginning of the PSP's life. And I really liked that game. It had a claymation style to it. But uh, I like the art style for this one. And... Oh, this is just... It's kind of satisfying making stuff blow up getting other things. I think uh, like collecting the energy and all that. Just taking out mobs of enemies. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so far so good. Ran out of power for that. This is the end of this phase. Um, let me know in the comments below what you think of this particular game. It is pretty spectacular. The HD Rumble works pretty well. It, like I said, it's kind of like Rezogun, but uh, artistically cartoony. And it'll be interesting to see where they go in later levels. Right now, it's mostly just like a lot of dodging these enemies. And like Defender without having to pick people up. Not too bad. Um, pretty decent little title on the eShop, especially if you want something that like feels decent with like the um, rumble and gives you kind of that Resogun challenge. There's not too many shooters on the uh, on the Switch currently. There's um, a couple ones from the um, ACA Neo Geo stuff, but this is more of a good modern shooter. Let me know in the comments below what you think of this game. Um, Hit that thumbs up if you haven't already. Hit that share button if you haven't already. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Oh, and make sure that you hit that little um, not bell, notification bell so that you are hopefully told whenever we have brand new videos out. And until the next video comes out, you are now caught up.